Hello everyone, 5 most important things of DevOps Center which you should know. This is a tool created by Salesforce to do the deployments in Salesforce and this will ultimately replace the chain sets. Uh, you remember with the chain sets it was really difficult to deploy if you have a very large package or if you have to add so many fields and so many things in a chain set it was really difficult because you need to pick everything one by one and it was very tire tiring process so salesforce devops center is there to replace such process number two see you can only dip, uh, you can only access devops center from the production or or uh, from your developer edition so you will not be able to access the uh, devops center from the sandboxes you need to have the production access you need to install the devops center there and then from there you can manage the pipeline and create the projects and everything if you are um, if you want to try this with your developer edition you need to create a couple of scratch org orgs to create a pipeline and then use your uh, developer edition as a production environment from there you can manage it so for someone who is going to learn this from the scratch for for, for for its own or not for the, the company's project or something they need to get a couple of scratch orgs and then treat it as the sandboxes and try try this at your uh, own developer edition number three once you create a a, a project in the uh, devops center you cannot delete it you will only get an option to rename it but you will not be able to delete this project so make sure that uh, you create a project which is not uh, just a dummy project uh, otherwise that there will just be a waste uh, number four is that currently it only supports git so if your company is using another source tracking tool like source tree or bitbucket currently it does not support but yes they do have all those things in pipeline to um, uh, to uh, you know develop so once they improve it they'll definitely be more support to other source tracking tools as well number five currently it has few limitations it is not integrated with the zira story so if your project is using something like zira then you have to uh, you know manage the user story on two places one will be the zira the other one will be the work items you will create within your devops center uh, the last thing is that it also have few limitations regarding the rollback so there is no rollback uh, uh, strategy available or rollback option available in the in the devops center and also merge conflict is bit bit complicated process and uh, does not fully support it so this is uh, i think in the initial phase once they improve it once they make sure that it is uh, scalable up to uh, uh, you know other devops uh, tool full fledged devops tool then this is going to be a really fun tool because it is really easy to use this i i uh, will suggest all my subscriber to try this in their developer edition and let me know if they have any question or if they face any problem